Alright, what's up guys? Welcome to a new Minecraft tutorial on the Portal Gun mod. Alright, let's get started. First thing you're going to have to do is go to the link in the description to the Portal Gun installer. This is so much easier than installing the actual mod itself, it really is. Go down, scroll down until you hit see download mod, which I've already done, so I'm not going to click that again. You can go ahead and just minimize that, you won't need it anymore. Open it up in WinRAR Archiver double click installers and double click portal mod installer. Just let that open up. <clears throat> it's very smart to have a fresh copy of Minecraft with you. I have my basic copy in here, which is the one I normally use when I'm just playing, but it has a bunch of mods in it and I didn't want to ruin it. So once you have a fresh copy of your of dot Minecraft or a fresh bin folder, hit install portal gun and a loading bar will come up. I've already done this so I'm not going to do it again. You can go ahead and spin my exit out of that. We don't need it anymore. Here's how to make a fresh copy. You can either delete this but if you want to keep all your stuff you may want to just delete your bin folder because then it won't delete all your saves and such or you can just make backups by dragging my here. I'm going to put that back in because I kind of need that. Alright, well, uh, let's jump into Minecraft and look at some of the stuff. Alright guys, here we are in Minecraft. I've got some of the basic things set up. I've got the two portal guns that it requires, the blue portal gun and the orange, as you can see there. Let's show it in action. I'm usually jumping around way faster, I know, because I've got a mod on my other copy, but I didn't decide to put it on this one. Look at that. It's amazing. Now you come out the other one. It's almost just like the game. It's pretty beautiful. And uh, from Portal 1, whenever you first see the portal gun, there's this podium, and it spins around and shoots the portals. I don't, I don't think you guys can hear the game volume, so I'll get a little closer to my speakers, that way you can maybe hear it a little bit. I just shot the wall over there. I'm not sure why it's not working. We'll go ahead and just shut that off for now. Oh great. Let's sleep. I don't, I don't have single player commands installed. got the material emancipation bucket which is allows you to place emancipation grids I don't know if you can hear them or not but they're talking incredibly loud stupid robots but boom I go through that and as you can see the blue portal that was over there is now gone and I just accidentally stepped on the spring pad <laughs> whoops I didn't even see which way I was walking Yes, that is the spring pad. <laughs> Let's see what it was actually called. The aerial faith plate, that's what it was called. And as you can see, we have the two turrets here, which will actually shoot. Ouch! They are quite easy to kill. Punch and punch. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. I've got a USB headset, so I don't think it records my speakers. And as you can see, what we have here, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm really not meaning to do that, I'm sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and remove that for now. There we go. Okay, so what we have here, as I admit many of you know, how amazing is that? Yeah, and here's the detector from the from the game. So let's try to get that in there. Let's see what we can do. And that detects it, usually turning on redstone or such, and you can open up doors with it. It's a pretty nice mod. I'm really enjoying it so far. This is the radio. Here, I'll put my 
my mic close to the speaker so you can hear it. This is hilarious. When I was setting this up last night before I went to bed so I could make sure to have this prepared, and I just found this mod awesome. Here we have the companion cube, the weighted, the weighted storage cube. I'm not sure what these checkpoint blocks do, because every time I place it on something it takes that, that form. It's a little weird. I'm not too, too sure what it does. And, uh, yeah, I think we've basically covered the basics. Let's see. Am I missing anything? I don't know why, but there's a lot of different storage, storage cubes in the too many items. But, who knows? They're probably all for different things. Ah, the knee, the advanced knee placement, replacement. I should probably have been using this when I used the spring pad, huh? The aerial faith plate, I mean. Of course. Of course that's what I mean. Let's do this. Nice. <laughs> I hit the wall and it made me land on this platform. That is pretty cool, actually. Okay. Let's see if I can get down. Yes. Pretty nice. Um, is there anything else I'm missing? There's these signs. <laughs> Huh. I couldn't really tell you how to make this stuff. I haven't really figured that out. I didn't say that on the post, and I didn't get on the actual portal post. So I'm sorry, I'm failing you. I guess this isn't really a how-to. It's a how-to install, but it's not really a how-to use everything. Now that's what I'm talking about. Wham. I love this. This is so cool. So, um, is that it? Alright, I guess that's it. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn off my microphone so it just records speaker sounds and I'll show you these amazing records. This was a triumph. I'm making a note here. Huge success. It's hard to overstate my satisfaction. Aperture science. We do what we must because we can. For the good of all of us, except the ones who are dead. But there's no sense crying over every mistake. You just keep on trying till you run out of cake Then the science gets done and you make a neat plan For the people who are still alive laughing under the circumstances I've been shockingly nice you want your freedom to be paid that's what I'm counting on I used to want you dead but now I only want you gone she was a lot like you Maybe not quite as heavy Now little Carolyn is in you too One day they woke me up 
so I could live forever. It's such a shame the same will never happen to you. You got your choice. And